Well, hello and welcome, people, to the internet to another adventure. My name is Ganians, and we are continuing on the Chubby Run in Lucky Hunter. Uh, this one has felt like it's going to go on for a little bit, so I might have ended up breaking this video into two parts. I'm not exactly sure what I'm doing, so I'm kind of recording a whole bunch of different parts. But anyway, if you're hearing this, it's likely broken up into two parts. So let's get going and continue on. If you didn't catch the first video, maybe go check that out but basically for a quick breakdown of why this is going so long first of all we're crushing it but also this artifact is kind of busted so the skull splitter when chubby's deal damage permanently reduce all enemies attack by three in the current battle so basically chubby's if you haven't seen them chubby's here attack multiple times and they do so every few turns or they attack big they, I was going to say, they attack bigly. They do a lot of damage every three turns, and we have a lot of these, like, ninjutsu banners to make them attack multiple times. So we're very drastically reducing the amount of damage that enemies are doing. And we're basically getting to a point, like, let's take a look at this turn here. Well, first of all, we just killed this guy because we did a million, 1.1 million. So I'm going to take a blue chubby here. I'm, I'm going to wait for a turn that maybe we don't kill something. Okay, that was a good turn. So I'm going to take... Uh, what am I going to take here? Probably none of these. None of these either. I think I'm just going to take the broken shield. But basically, you can see here, we're basically going to reduce his attack every time we attack. And so it gets to a point like right here where he has no attack. So he can't hurt us. And we also have a decent amount of shield. We also have an artifact that we retain some of the shield every turn. Ooh, I don't like any of these. I guess I'll just go for Messenger. So we get to a point where the enemy just can't hit us. So we're just kind of cruising through. I'm going to take a general so I can sell it. And so because of that, there... So basically, there are times where... I'll take a blue Messenger. There are times where we can kind of just if we don't have a lot of damage which isn't the case anymore because these chubbies have been pumped up so much or they're getting pumped up i should say because we also have an artifact let's see where is it where is it it's the range one so it's that blue range one that i just hovered over it increases the range of surrounding grids which basically means the like flags and spears typically it targets these surrounding units or you can think about it in it targets the three by three box on the the outside of its radius but because it increases the surrounding grid by plus one it makes it so that it's a four by four grid and so all our things that are increasing like our stats are reaching all our units way more so we're basically not dying and we're doing big damage so what artifacts now soft and plump we don't care about all pieces gain attack plus 20% in one turn when obtaining a piece. So we probably want to do this. It's a little... I don't know how this stacks. Because you obtain a piece at the beginning of the turn before you have any attack boosts. So we're not getting 20% off of the boosted attack. Which kind of sucks. That being said, I think I'm still gonna I think I'm still gonna upgrade it. I'm gonna upgrade this and I'm gonna upgrade this for more crit. How are we doing on shields? I have two blue shields, so let's combine those, to make a purple shield. We also have two green shields, so I gotta keep an eye out for a green shield. Uh, don't really care about any of this. Okay, I'll take a green general so that way we can sell it. Yeah, so we have situations like this where our damage isn't super great. But again, because the enemy can't hit us, so this is kind of... I think this is what's going to end up ending our run, is a unit like this, where we're going to get to a point where they just gain so much attack per turn that we can't outpace it. But the thing is, I think it's a lot farther down the road than we're at right now. <laughs> so the run has kind of been taking a, a little while. It's been taking its toll. So uh, I think I'm just going to take the treasure chest here just because, again, we can sell it. 
just build up that gold so that way we can upgrade more pieces. We can upgrade our artifacts. We'll take a gre three green chubbies. That's totally fine. Oh, I guess we can take a blue chubby camp. It's fine. I don't want any of these, so we'll just take the barbell. Sail fodder, basically. Blue chubby camp. Let's go. We are just, we're pooping out some high level. We'll take a soldier so that way we can sell it. We're just pooping out some high level chubbies. We got a, a lot of things in our inventory though. Which is, uh, you know, again, kind of one of those things that, yeah. Okay, so this might be what I was, yeah, see, we, we have turns like that and then it just saves us. But it's going to be turns, it's going to be enemies like that, that end up beating us that just have major damage increases and we just can't we just can't outpace it with the amount of hits we're doing gold banner triggers one times ten sure I I will take three legendary chubbies take a free broken sword Take a blue chubby camp, make a purple chubby camp, make some more purple chubbies. We will take a green broken sword, that's fine, because again, it's free. Take a regular broken sword, because it's free, although that damage is... It's basically irrelevant <laughs> at this point. And you can see, especially in these longer fights, I'm honestly just going to take this just because it's green and I can sell it for more. It, it's these type of fights that go long because we have the this fortification down here, which is making it so that we retain 10% of our armor. So if the fights go long and they're not dealing any damage, we can just keep holding on to our armor. And it gives us kind of some reprieve that we can kind of hold off the enemies. Purple treasure chest, let's go. Broken sword, 243. Well, that's a decent pickup. That is better than the gray sword, which gives, like, what? Two? Three? At this point, I'm just picking stuff up to sell. Not that it's necessarily it's good, because we're, we're kind of diluting our, our inventory here. But after this, I'll be selling a bunch of stuff. All right, let's go ahead and sell off a bunch of stuff. Sell this. We'll sell this flag. Don't need that. Let's go ahead and sell. This is fine to sell. This is fine to sell. We'll sell the gray messenger. Don't want barbells. Barbells aren't very great. Sell the blue. Oh, what else do we want? What else do we want to do? Oh, the ninjas. Ninjas can go. These are better than the banners, so I think I'm just going to get rid of this one banner. And at this point, the spears aren't very good. I mean, <laughs> nine attack when we're doing... <laughs> A mill? <laughs> get out of here. I'm going to get rid of the blue spear as well. I will hold on to the purple spears. That is a that is a reasonable amount of attack. Especially when we're doing multi-hits. 
and I'll keep these because then if we just get one green shield, they combine and then they stack, they go into a blue shield and they go into a purple and then they make gold. So they just kind of cascade. Let's go demon merchant. Additionally gain 10% armor. Seems kind of overkill to be completely honest. But that's fine. 1.5 mil on a minion. Okay. And we're safe. So don't have to worry about damage. This is such a this is such a busted run. This is such a busted run. There's our green shield. So that's now these are gonna cascade. Curse shield, we definitely do not need or want. I'll just take a blue ninja. Purple chub camp, let's go. Take the barbell for, for selling fodder. So this is easily, easily the best run I have ever had in Lucky Hunter. And I'm going to be honest. I, I think I mentioned it again, depending on if I broke this video up into one part or two parts. I either mentioned it in the first well, I can't even say first half of this video because I don't even know how long this video would be. First part video, first hour. <laughs> I mentioned the first hour. I think that this might be broken. I think that that likely has to be changed so that it is just, it's not permanent. It reduces it just for a turn. Because if you start building up multi attacks, it gets so silly. I literally don't care about any of this. My my money is fine. Oh, we're starting to get hit a little bit. Okay, hold up now. Could this be the end of the run? Nope. <laughs> nope, not even close. <laughs> oh, it's silly. Oh, it's so silly. And our inventory is just flooded. And we're doing a bunch of crit because we have, where is it? Where is it? For each piece in the inventory, we get two crit rate. So we're getting an additional 50% crit rate. So we're doing okay here on damage. Which is why basically all this damage is critical. I don't, uh, I forgot if the crit is separate damage. So I can't say for certain if it's just that, uh, that portion of the damage is crit. I don't think it is. I actually don't know, so I'm actually not going to comment on that. Great sword. Okay, so we're trying to turn this great sword into obviously combine it with the with the purple with or with the blue great sword. Take a blue soldier. Yeah, I'm not going to waste my time taking grays. At this point, probably not even greens, unless they're like good greens. Like this, uh, you know, I said that I probably will take greens. They still sell for a reasonable amount, but grays at this point, I'm not even going to bother with. Oh, we're taking a little bit of damage here. Hold up, hold up. I will take a gold soldier. And you're dead. <laughs> okay. I was a little, I had a little bit of concern there. A tiny bit. A smidgen, if you will. Yeah, we have a lot, a lot of chubbies. Um, maybe I, I don't, you know what? I don't want to screw this up, but, but it might be time to get rid of my camps. I guess the question is, 
You know, I think it's actually going to be more reasonable just to blacksmith this up to purple than this. I guess the question is, is it worth it to keep the camps around? You know what? It's 100% not. Where? Wait, where are all my messengers? Oh, I only have two messengers? Okay, I need to start working on more messengers. I think it's probably not worth it to keep these around. I was going to say, for, for like farming purposes, because I could keep selling these... But the thing is, it means that my messengers are going to be targeting the camps, and I don't know that I act and I don't actually want that. This can go. I think these can go as well. Hmm. Because I can just pay to turn this into a red camp. Yeah, so let's get rid of the purple ones. Right? Because I can just pay to upgrade this. We're going to get rid of these chubbies. We don't need them anymore. The only reason I'm keeping these is because of the, uh, the, attack, up, the attack up. Okay, so we come in here. Oh my god, that's freaking expensive. Okay, this great sword is awful. We're actually just going to sell this. So, oh, this is already wait. Okay, so there's a little bit of error here because this implies that we can upgrade it, but it also says it's max level, which is probably a good thing. This would be insanely busted. This as well. This is already max level, but it says that we can upgrade it. So, uh, oh, what is, I want to upgrade, yeah, at this point I want to upgrade this, because I want to make it so that our, our, whatever it is, our mastered, we'll call it mastered, our mastered chubbies can take on flags, because right now they're just basic. And then, yeah, this, this sword is awful. At this point, it's, it's just not even close to being scaled. So, we're losing a lot of crit. Okay, so at this point, I just want to get more messengers. We lost a lot of crit, but again, that doesn't matter. If we can hit multiple times, we, we just take no damage. And now that we're safe here, I'm going to start taking things to sell again. Uh, uh, yeah, I'll take that, because again, it's something we can sell. Nah, not even going to waste my time with that. What was the logic there? I don't know. Purple treasure chest. Perfect. Now we get a gold treasure chest. Yeah, because we like that. That is okay. Take that to sell it. No, not even bothering with the grays. So, at this point... At this point... I will take that just because it's three purples. Oh! Oh, is this the end of the run? Is this the end of the run? Hold up. Nope. Nope. <laughs> no, every time I'm like, is this the end? No, it's not. <laughs> Although I think we have, too, we might have too many chubbies now. I might need to calm it down on the chubbies.
So we're, we're, we're going to likely hit, or it's possible we already hit the point, and I haven't figured that out yet. Sure, we'll take that. I mean, that's just absurd. We're, we're going to hit a point at some, at some time, if we haven't already, where we kind of cross... How do, how do I explain it? We're going to cross over a point where we have too many chubbies. I don't know what that point is. And I don't know if we've already hit that point. But we can kind of see that that is likely going to be our, our downfall here eventually. Well, I'm going to hit the bonfire. Let's go to our inventory. Definitely get rid of this. We'll definitely get rid of this. Get rid of this. I think I might actually... Am I going to sell off a couple chubbies? Yeah, let me sell off like one or two of these ones that have less tax. Like this one that has 1.21. 1.21. Just kind of looking here. Okay, we might be, we might be good. No, I'm going to get rid of the blue banner. Do I get rid of the blue shields? I think I do. Okay, let's give this a shot. 9.92 mil. Yeah. We're in reasonable number territory here. Okay. Yep. Yeah, see, this is this is what I was I was wondering about. We're gonna get into this kind of situation where his his first Okay, well, we're we're good here. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> we just leveled up a shield, got a whole bunch of... Yeah. Yeah, I will take a legendary. I will take the 15% crit. That I will take. And now we're just never taking damage again. Oh, we did take damage. Hold up. Take a sword. Yeah, see, the question is, is, is he going to be able to outpace the amount of times that I'm hitting him? And it is possible. It's not this turn, though. I see, it could have been that turn. Yeah, we'll take a purple shield. Definitely need to protect ourselves a little bit more. Go broken sword again. You know, I'm gonna take the chubby can't just again, it's a legendary thing that I can sell. Cause we're we're good on chubbies at this point. We do not need more chubbies. And I will take the flag though, so that way I think they can buy. Okay, so green can't combine with chubbies eat with the red chubbies. Yeah, I think... So, maybe I'm misreading this. Just take this, because it's another thing we can sell. When same level chubby and flag of less than or equal... Less than or equal to six... So like even the purple chubby isn't combining. Wait, so if we go white, blue, green, purple, yellow, red. No, there's only six rarities. I was thinking maybe this is like a, a seventh rarity and it's higher than that, right? White, blue, white, green, blue, purple, yellow, red. Okay, I'm going to have to wait till after the battle. I, I, it's kind of annoying that I can't look at... Or actually, duh. Okay, so when same level chubby and flag... And, oh, when same level chubby and flag of less than or equal to six are on the field, they would be... Oh, 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 oh. 
Got it. Okay, so the reason that I can't combine these... Oh, okay, so I've kind of messed up here. So what I need to be doing... Okay, I need to I need to rethink. Okay, I figured it out. We're we're gonna talk about it after after this battle, because I I've I I see where I've screwed up. Jesus, damage received minus twenty percent. We're just never gonna die. So where I've screwed up here is that it's not combining a chubby with a flag. It's combining three chubbies and a flag. So actually, what I need here is at this point I need the so I do need the gold so I do so I'm gonna get rid of some of these red chubbies because the red chubbies can't combine anymore what I need is flags to then combine with the gold chubbies and then the gold chubbies will combine into red flag chubbies so that's that's what I need Okay, we fi we figured it out. You guys probably figured it out much faster than I did. And so we're going to keep these flags, so that way we can combine them. And at this point, I'm just looking for the lowest chubbies to get a couple more out of here. Okay. None of these matter. Might as well just take the Beast Tycoon. So at this point, I'm trying to recycle my inventory. Take the purple shield. And slowly get rid of red, red single chubbies and combine gold chubbies. Nothing here. What? It, randomly, randomly combine four surrounding pieces of different types one time? What? What does that even... Hang on. What, is, what does that even do? Okay, it's not on the board this time. I have never seen this piece before. Hang on. Let's slow this down again. Again, just because I want to see what it combines them into. Okay, it's not here. I'll play through the turn fast. But then I'm going to slow it down at the beginning of each turn. Man, come on, Fusion Capsule. Come out. Don't be scared. Oh, there he is. What in the heck? Oh, here we go. This, this might be the round that we start to lose it. Gold shield, perfect. There we go. Yeah, now we're starting to get some some flat. Oh, oh, buddy. Oh, buddy. Yeah, these guys are dealing big, big damage now. So the question is going to be, can we survive it? We're still holding our own. Let's grab another flag. Gold messenger, great. Okay, so the fusion guy is cracked. See, this is what I'm talking about. Oh, okay, we survived. It's these first... Okay, so now, now we're safe. But it's those first turns where if we have low shield, that could really screw us over.
because he might just be gaining too much attack. Okay, we're still good on shield. Oh, okay, that, that was the turn that just sealed it. That was the turn that sealed it in our favor. So, he fused... A messenger, a spear, and one of the treasure units into this chubby. That is crazy. I have never seen that. Okay, we're going to start clearing out again some of these weaker chubbies. What else we got? 1.6? Another 1.2? Because we still have these four chubbies down here. I think I'm just going to get rid of these blue chubbies. I don't think the blue chubbies are... Uh, but they do give attack bonuses. No, we already have four. Yeah, I'm going to get rid of these, these weaker chubbies. Because I don't think that I'm ever going to be fusing them. Okay. Let's go to Blacksmith. Let's see. We could turn this into gold, but that's... Uh, I don't know that that's worth it. We could check out some more artifacts. That's already max level. Crit rate when merging pieces. And then let's look at upgrading. I'm going to upgrade this flag, so that way it can combine into... A chubby as a purple rather than rather than a blue. And everything else I'm too broke for. Let's go ahead and upgrade that messenger. We're getting lucky here with our shields. Don't want any of that. Don't want any of that. Nope, don't care for any of it. Okay, we still got enough shield to keep us around. We might be okay. We, we have a lot of... Ooh. Nope, we don't want any of that. Uh... Oh, wait, okay, because they only attack... They attack once every two turns. Oh, my God. We're, it's like... It's so close to ending, but we're just barely hanging on. Just barely hanging on. Okay, we're good. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> it's so close. It's so close. If this was attack every turn, we would be so dead. But we're just barely hanging on. Oh, we'll take another legendary shield. Those are going to fuse. Oh, my God. So much shield. 243 shield. I'll take a purple general to sell. And now he can't hurt us. So we're safe. Need more flags. I just had two, two legendaries combine. Or I had three legendaries combined into a, a regular, regular red chubby. Which I do not want, but I also don't want the gray flags. Oh my god, we got another one. Okay, there's a this is another shot that we could. Oh my god, every time. There's a split second before this pops up that my heart goes, you're dead. <laughs> and then I don't die. <laughs> Is this the turn I die? Oh my god, we the damage reduction is crazy. <sighs> Cause we receive we receive damage receive. Wait, why is this so absurd? Why does it say minus 77% damage? Excuse me? I don't even want to take this because I don't want them to fuse together. 
Where is this coming from? Oh, our health. Oh, our health. This might be the turn. Nope. <laughs> Again. <laughs> One second. I think this is the turn. I think we're I think we're dead here. Nope, we just gained a ton of Oh my god. <laughs> Hanging on by a thread. Hanging on by an absolute thread. Uh sure. It's so close. I'm going to be honest. I'm a little hungry, so it's a little bit bittersweet. I'm kind of not hoping to lose because I want to see how far we can get. But I'm kind of like, if I were to lose, is it the worst thing in the world? All right. There we go. There we go. Oh, my gosh. How how high was that hunter record? 53. Dude, that's insane. Someone commented on one of the last videos I did that they made it to around 101. That must have taken you hours. <laughs> Unless you just had more damage than me, but holy crap. The chubbies. Okay, so based on everything, I'm gonna keep this into one video because I wasn't sure how long it would go. And you know, an hour and a half is fine for a video. But holy crap, the chubbies, man. I I think that relic, I don't <sighs> So I guess I guess what I'm thinking is. Well, I guess what I'm thinking is there's only endless mode, which is a little bit strange. I'm going to be honest. It, it feels a little strange that there's only an endless mode because it kind of feels like I'm trying to figure out, like, what is the point of the game? Which, so, I mean, some people would say the point of the game is just, is just to have fun and go in as far as possible. But for me, I like I've talked about this in several other videos where I like having specific goals. So... I'm hoping that when Hucky, <laughs> Hucky Lunter, that's what we're going to call it now, the Hucky Lunter game, when Lucky Hunter comes out, I hope that there's more of, maybe not a campaign, but something to give you some kind of progression. Maybe, and this could be an easy, an easy option. You already have Hunter record here. Maybe you just add an online, online leaderboard. So that way you can see, I don't know how you would end up doing that though. Well, uh, well, obviously it's easy enough to do. But I almost, because if you did an online leaderboard, I would think that you would want to highlight what, what faction that the decks are built around, but you can have builds that are multi-faction. I don't know that you would necessarily want to, but you could. So I don't know how you would highlight that because I think that would be important to, I think it would be important because then you could highlight if there are any balance issues between the factions which ultimately isn't a, a big thing, right? Because it's not like you're competing against people. But if the developer does want players to have more of a reason to try all the different factions, I could see why you'd want to have them a little bit more balanced. But that being said, though, again, it's like, what is the, what is the, and is there an end state to this game where you where you've quote unquote completed the game or are working towards completion. I don't know. I don't know what that looks like or if it's even necessary. Again, that's just my personal preference to have something that to, to work towards. And currently the only thing that we're really working towards is the meta progression here and unlocking all this, which we can unlock the last faction here. But uh, yeah, I don't know. I mean, th this is a sweet run. This is a fun run. I definitely enjoyed it. If you guys enjoyed it, you know, I know this was longer than most of the other videos I put out. But if you guys enjoyed it, please leave a like on the video and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Here we play all kinds of roguelikes, roguelites, deck and dice builders, tactical strategy games, auto battlers, and so much more. But guys, I have been Ganyans. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you all next time.